Hey guys, welcome back to Sea Witch World. Hola, como esta, amigos? You guys, we're here today, guys, cooking on the grill. Can you see the steam flowing? The grill is popping, y'all. Yes, guys, we have some perch, ocean perch, and that's a that's a type of fish for those of you who doesn't know what perch is. And we have shrimp, broccoli, and rice cauliflower, guys. Praise God, bless the food, guys, and then we're gonna get to eating. Let us pray. Most holy and wise God, Father, we thank you for this food. We ask that it be nourishment and strength for our bodies. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Look, we're gonna be talking today about three reasons why people quit their diet. Okay, so guys, stay tuned. We're gonna be talking about that, but right now we're gonna get some food on these plates. Yes. What you want first? You wanna give me some rice? And some broccoli, and then I'll give you fish. Oh, uh -uh, that's enough for me right now. Okay, yeah, give me a little broccoli. Yep. And you want rice cauliflower? Y'all know we we be killing that. Yes. Guys, I fish have had a busy day. Therefore, I know you had a busy day when I called you. You um, you act like you didn't want to talk. Look, I knew you were gonna say that. Yeah. I just wanted to finish so I could get home mm -hmm. and eat. I was like, my goal was finish this I'm get you some fish. so that you can get home and eat. Because I'm still doing OMAD, guys. Still doing OMAD. So you can wait for that meal. Oh, we're going to show your food what it looks like. I put one piece of fish on there. You might want another piece. But okay, well, I'll start off with one. Let the other one stay on the piece. Looking for me. good. Nice and light and flaky. Well, that's good. I'm glad you like it. Mm. Yo, I'm hungry. Um. All right, so we got what three reasons why people quit? Mm-hmm. All right. And what's our first reason? This is good, y'all. The main reason is they haven't disciplined themselves. Mm-hmm. You gotta make it up in your mind that you wanna lose weight. Can't nobody do it for you. You just gotta have your mind set. Get get yourself together, go out shop, get what you need, and um, just put your mind to it. You got to do it, you know. Especially if you got health reasons or some kind of issues that, you know, you gotta diet. Or just wanna lose weight. I think it's important that when you get that mindset that you're doing it for yourself, mm -hmm. not for nobody else. Right. Not to look good for somebody, not you know for your main and think you know more of you or whatever. Do it because you're gonna feel better, you're gonna look better, and your health will improve. Yes, there are some conditions that weight may not solve, but there are a lot of conditions that weight will solve. Well, I'm so, doing it for you, babe. You're doing it for me. Yeah, I'm doing oh, it for you. That's so sweet. I want to last. I want to live my long life with you. Okay. Awesome. Awesome. Mm -hmm. I mean, and that's great because you're doing it for longevity. That's against the world. You <laughs> get in the brain. You get in the brain. <laughs> but yeah, and that is, you, you do it for your loved ones. Yeah. As far as here. for longevity, not for, you know, to look good. You mm -hmm. know, that's just a bonus. You know, just a bonus. Yeah. yeah. But anyway, um, yeah, you have to discipline yourself. Mm-hmm. What's the next one? We're not gonna hold y'all on. We just wanna share I'm some you, this, support with y'all. This food is really good. It, it's, it's not heavy, but mm -hmm. it's so good. We just wanna share some support. I'm coming with y'all. What's our next one? And what if you make up in your mind? You may be out get some more broccoli. And you discipline yourself. You must not sabotage yourself. Ooh, that's a big one there. That's a big one. I did that to myself a lot. That's a huge one right there. It's bad enough somebody else sabotage you because we get that all the time. Ooh. But when you sabotage yourself. Mm. Yeah, that's bad. One may ask, well, how? What are you talking about? I'm talking about when you purchase something 
knowingly that you really like that item, that um food or beverage, mm -hmm. and you have it in your house. Yep. You're going to eat it. You might say, well, I'm just having it in the house so when the kids come over or when the grandkids come over. Mm -mm. Now, like, if you're having something at your house, okay, and let's say you want a dessert for the people because they're not on a, any type of diet, make them eat it and make them take it with them. Eat it and wrap it up so you take this home. Do not let it stay at your no. house. No. Because that's what. Somebody gave us the pie, and Burr, we put it in the freezer. <laughs> Wrap that joker up. We wrapped it up and put it in the freezer. We'll save it for a celebration. If it would have stayed in our refrigerator, brother would have took it out. Oh, I'm yeah. telling you, I would have took it out. Yep. Oh, yeah. So you got to get that stuff out your house, and then you're going to feel like you failed. If you eat it, after you eat it, you're going to feel this guilt, this big sense of guilt, and you're going to feel so bad, you know? And think about I've been there and done it so many times. Most things, you don't have to throw it away. I had a short time. If you think you're wasting, wrap it up and put it in the freezer. Mm -hmm. You know, you might be able to pull it out, you know, on a special occasion or something, you know, eat it later, but right now, when you get your grind on, don't let nothing mess it up. Mm -mm. Nope. Oh yeah. Mm. It's of, so easy to happen. So easy. A lot of people fail simply because they don't have the support they need. Yep. So, that's what we come and play at. We're here to support you. Yeah. I wish that your household or, you know, whoever you're living with or somebody, your significant other, husband, wife, whatever, would support you during this journey. I really wish that. And if they hear this, please support that person. They need you. This is important. Very important. It's a way of showing love that support. Yeah. So, a lot of people fail because they don't have that support. I am truly glad that I do have that support. And I don't take it for granted. You know? So. I'm throwing down, y'all. <laughs> I'm throwing down. Mm -hmm. No, yeah, but it's very important. It's very important that you support each other. Um, because I do want to be here for my grandkids. I do want to have um, a good life. I don't want high blood pressure. I don't want sugar diabetes. I don't want none of that bad stuff. I want to be able to run and jump in the ocean and swim, whatever I need. Not yeah. the ocean. Yeah. Why not? If I'm going to swim, why not jump Let's in the ocean? Let's stick with the pool. <laughs> All right, well, jump in the pool and swim if I want to. And um, even just going around like on vacation, you'd be out of be out of breath. You don't want to walk nowhere. Remember when we went to Puerto Rico? When we went to Puerto Rico, y'all, we were overweight so bad. We didn't even want to walk to the store. <laughs> what accent? Remember, we had to walk to the store when we was yeah, in Puerto Rico. That wasn't all-inclusive. Right, but the Puerto Rico trip... I was trying to remember. Anyway, all I know is our last vacation was mm -hmm. great. Yeah. Last so. couple vacation. Yeah, but they were all inclusive. Yeah. 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 But you don't have to walk nowhere to get your but food or nothing. Like, right. No. So, but we still enjoyed it. We were yeah, together. We, we had a time out. But um, we're not gonna hold y'all long. We just wanted to share those three points with you. What was those three points, babe? Will we be reiterated? You know? It was discipline, discipline, sa sabotage, sabotage, and lack of support. And lack of support. All right. So we just want to share those um, points with y'all, and we just want to let y'all know we're here for the support, and we're gonna check out, right, babe? Yeah. Anything else you got to say? Um. Another, I gotta add one more thing, guys. I got to add this because this is something I do. Well, I used to do. 
I used to get so discouraged by what the scale said. I get on the scale, I get on the scale every day. Don't get on the scale every no. day. Mm -mm. Sometimes you're losing inches, but you're not losing pounds. Please don't do that. That can be a deal breaker. You just like, I'm not losing no weight, so I might as well just eat whatever I want to eat. But your clothes fit in better. Yes. Mm -hmm. So don't let that scale trick you. And you can be gaining muscle too. You could be gaining out. muscle. Or mm -hmm. Especially the guys in different weights. If you're not drinking enough water, it could be water retention, so you need to drink plenty of water. So, guys, don't let this scale trick you. And don't eat before you go to bed. Because if you eat like something salty, all that salt, all that um, retention, water retention stays on your body. You get up in the morning, you weigh, you're going to be overweight. But all it is water retention. Yep. All right. All right. We're going to check out, y'all. Don't Let forget to subscribe, like, and share. All right. We love y'all. Peace out. Peace Have out. Have a great day.